in the dimly lit attic of an old, creaky mansion. Forgotten by time, a dusty, ornate mirror stood, shrouded in mystery. The mansion had belonged to the wealthy Thornfield family for generations, but no one dared enter the attic. Legends whispered that the mirror was enchanted, but its true power remained a chilling secret. The story began with young Emily Thornfield, an adventurous soul who had inherited the mansion after her parents' untimely demise. Emily was drawn to the attic, sensing a strange allure emanating from the locked door. One moonless night, she decided to unravel the mirror's mysteries with an antique key that had been passed down through her family. Emily unlocked the attic door. The room was filled with an eerie silence, broken only by her echoing footsteps. The mirror, veiled in a tattered cloth, stood in the corner. She hesitated for a moment before uncovering it. As the cloth fell away, Emily gasped in awe. The mirror was a work of unparalleled beauty. Its frame was adorned with intricate carvings of twisted vines, and its surface was like a pool of liquid. Silver, the room's reflection in the mirror seemed off, as though it showed another dimension. Emily, unable to resist its allure, reached out and touched the mirror's surface. Her reflection rippled, and then something strange happened. Her reflection smiled, but she didn't. Panic gripped her as her reflection slowly turned to face her, its smile stretching wider than any human should. What are you? Emily stammered, stepping back. The reflection didn't answer, but beckoned her with a bony finger. As if under a spell, Emily couldn't resist and approached the mirror. Suddenly, her reflection lunged forward, its skeletal hands breaking through the glass. Emily screamed as she was pulled into the mirror's twisted world. Inside, Emily found herself in a nightmarish realm. The sky was blood red, and the ground was a jagged expanse of cracked earth. Tormented souls roamed, their eyes hollow and their faces eternally contorted in anguish. Emily realized she had become one of them. Trapped within the mirror's malevolent grasp, she tried to escape, but the mirror was a prison. Unbreakable and unforgiving, each day, she relived her worst fears, and each night, the mirror's malevolent power drained a part of her. Soul, years passed, and the mansion became a place of fear and dread. People avoided it, believing it to be cursed, but one day, a curious young woman named Sarah decided to investigate the mansion's dark history. Armed with knowledge of the Thornfield family's mysterious disappearance, she ventured into the haunted mansion. In the attic, she uncovered the enchanted mirror, still shrouded in its tattered cloth. As she approached, the mirror seemed to call to her. Its power too strong to resist, Sarah hesitated, her hand trembling as she reached out to touch its surface. As soon as her fingers made contact, Sarah's reflection in the mirror began to ripple, but she resisted its pull. With every ounce of her strength, she pushed against the mirror's enchantment. Suddenly, the mirror shattered, releasing a blinding burst of energy that sent her sprawling backward, gasping for breath. Sarah realized she had freed Emily's tormented soul and the mansion began to crumble around her. She rushed to escape, and just as the last brick fell, she emerged from the mansion's ruins, clutching a small shard of the enchanted mirror. Sarah vowed to find a way to release Emily's trapped soul from the shard, but she couldn't deny the lingering feeling that a fragment of the mirror's malevolence had taken root within her. The haunted mansion was gone, but the curse of the enchanted mirror would haunt her dreams for the rest of her life. And so, the legend of the Thornfield Mansion and its cursed mirror continued, a chilling reminder that some secrets should never be uncovered.